Welcome to the singularity, where the lines between man and machine blur and humanity's future is unknown. For decades, scientists, philosophers, and futurists have debated the concept of singularity, which predicts a future in which technology surpasses human intelligence and irreversibly alters the course of our existence. But, what exactly is singularity? What are the many theories about its possible arrival? Most importantly, what does it indicate for our species' future? In this video, we'll look at the various theories on singularity and compare and contrast them to help you understand this complex and fascinating subject. So buckle on, because we're about to take a trip into the future, and the possibilities are both fascinating and unsettling. Part 2, The Theory of Technological Singularity The idea of technological singularity is one of the oldest ideas about singularity, and it was initially proposed by the renowned mathematician and computer scientist, John von Neumann. The singularity, according to this theory, will occur as a direct result of the exponential expansion of computing power. According to the concept of technological singularity, the future evolution of artificial intelligence will proceed in tandem with the expansion of computing capability. This, in turn, will lead to the development of increasingly more advanced AI, resulting in a self-sustaining, runaway effect that would eventually result in the singularity. Part 3, The Intelligence Explosion Theory the intelligence explosion theory approaches the concept of the singularity from a somewhat different angle. According to this concept, first postulated by thinker and mathematician I. J. Good, the singularity would occur when artificial intelligence reaches a particular level of intelligence. At this point, artificial intelligence will be capable of exponentially improving itself, resulting in a tremendous increase in intelligence that will eventually lead to the singularity. The intelligence explosion theory differs from the technological singularity theory in that the former emphasizes the exponential expansion of computing power while the latter emphasizes the rapid increase in intelligence. If these theories make you question the world we live in as we know it, do subscribe to our channel as we do delve much deeper into the puzzling questions the world has to offer. The fourth part of the cyborg singularity theory. According to the cyborg singularity theory, humans and machines will mate in the not-too-distant future to create a new species, which will subsequently experience the singularity. This hypothesis posits that as technology advancement continues, humans will become increasingly reliant on it, eventually leading to the blending of humans and machines. Some proponents of the cyborg singularity believe it will occur as a result of the use of cybernetic implants, while others believe it will occur as a result of the development of artificial intelligence capable of merging with human consciousness. The cyborg singularity hypothesis is a novel perspective on the singularity notion, with a focus on the relationship that exists between people and various forms of technology. Part 5 discusses the spiritual singularity theory. In contrast to the technological singularity hypothesis, the intelligence explosion singularity theory, and the cyborg singularity theory, the spiritual singularity theory proposes that the singularity will occur when people achieve a state of spiritual enlightenment and transcend physical existence. People, according to this concept, our spiritual creatures, and technological advancement will one day allow us to escape our bodies and acquire a level of enlightenment that will allow us to transcend physical reality. According to the spiritual singularity idea, the singularity will occur when humanity has advanced to the point where they are no longer confined by their physical existence and can perceive the true essence of reality. The spiritual singularity idea suggests that the singularity can be comprehended spiritually and focuses an emphasis on humanity's spiritual development. Despite the fact that each of these hypotheses presents a somewhat different take on what the singularity will involve and how it will occur, they all agree that it will have a huge impact on humanity. The technological and intelligence explosion theories, for example, emphasize technological and AI advancements as the driving force behind singularity, whereas the cyborg and spiritual singularity notions focus on the merging of human and machine or the spiritual progress of humanity. It is critical to remember that these hypotheses are not mutually exclusive, and that their conceptions and forecasts may overlap to some extent. It is possible that the singularity may occur as a result of exponential growth in computing power, which will result in an intelligence explosion, which would then result in the merging of people and machines or spiritual enlightenment. The effects of the singularity are both exhilarating and terrifying, depending on one's perspective. On the one hand, singularity holds the potential to bring in a future full of unimaginable prospects and huge advances in technology and medicine. It is feasible that this may herald in an age of abundance, with a limitless supply of resources and the resolution of all of humanity's problems. On the other hand, singularity raises questions about humanity's future and our place in the world. It's feasible that in the future, machines could outperform humans in intelligence, rendering humans obsolete and forcing us to reconsider what it means to be human. 
If you enjoyed this content and want to see more please like and subscribe to our channel. Bye for now.